Engineers solve problems that make a difference in people's lives. In this first activity, the students will have an opportunity to explore the problem presented in this module. They will have the opportunity to do various everyday tasks only with the use of one hand. They will learn which types of tasks are more difficult with one hand, and then they will learn that devices that are designed to make those tasks easier are called assistive technology. In the first part of this activity, we'll use a rubber band and a sock to impair our student's hand, and they will have to identify th some things in a mystery container. First, ask the students to put their hand inside a sock, and then put a rubber band over their fist like this. That will look like this. The hand will go inside the sock, and then the rubber band will go over the fist. This will keep students from trying to open up their hands and grab things like this. At that point, ask the class to do some basic tasks like tying their shoes, or any other tasks you can think of that would be difficult with only one hand. Now let's move on to the mystery box. For each group, you'll need to find a container and four or six random objects such as a mug, TV remote, keys, battery, perhaps a marker, and some tape. The only requirement is that the objects be safe to pick up without looking at them. No scissors or other sharp objects. The group should follow their student handouts on their own and try to guess what the objects are with their sock covered hand without looking at them. After the activity, follow the instructor's guide for information on closing the activity. Ask the students what they noticed when they were trying to perform tasks or discover objects with only one hand. For the second part of the activity closure, we'll ask students to brainstorm tasks that would be difficult with only one hand. Now that they've had the opportunity to try a few things, they should be able to brainstorm lots of things in everyday life that are difficult. Write these on the board and then select one for the students to try to design a device to help people with. Then, give each student a sheet of paper and ask them to draw a device that would help somebody solve that particular problem. They're playing the role of engineers in this activity. Ask them to be as creative as possible. Any device goes. And at the end, ask them to present their ideas to the rest of the group.